I heard a lady on here say that you can't be a cheater and a good parent, and I totally disagree. One of the best things that I ever did for myself and my mental health was separate my relationship with my father from his relationship with my mother. I tell people all the time, he was a great dad, he was a terrible husband, and people don't understand how I can say that. Because he was a good dad. He was the best dad that he could be given the skills that he had. I don't know if that's the case for him being a husband because he wasn't my husband. That's for him and my mother to navigate. And quite frankly, it's none of my business. What I do know is that once I separated that relationship, and me and my father got to know each other as adults because this happened probably when I was around 18. He and I became incredibly, incredibly close and he opened up to me. And I was able to understand him as an individual. Him as a black man growing up in the 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s. Him as a black man having to go out into society and make decisions for his family. Him with three girls having to navigate how to raise us so that we are independent. A lot of the ways that I am is because of my dad. So it helped me understand him as a man. And I was able to take those relation, that relationship and the lessons I learned from that relationship into other relationships with men because I had a good father in my life. But the main thing that I had to do was separate myself. Him and my mother's relationship is theirs. It is absolutely none of my business to interfere with that. She made decisions. He made decisions. They made decisions together. They did the best they could with what they had. And that's pretty much what it is.